Hey everyone, welcome back. This is DHTV and today we're going to be reviewing the free app Sidewalker for your iPad, iPod Touch or iPhone. Let's get started. All right, so this is Sidewalker and basically what you're trying to do within this game is try to get this character, Johnny, to work on time. He's extremely late. If you've ever been late to work in the big city, you know there's a lot of things that you need to avoid. So that's what you gotta do in this game. You need to avoid the obstacles. So whether it's a fire hydrant, a car, a person, you wanna try to get around them as quickly as you can. And as you can see, I just picked up a pair of pants because my character was sort of half naked. Now these people in the yellow, these big yellow people, you can actually Actually just plow through them they're just tourists so why not but uh, anybody else if you run into them you will be fired or lose a piece of clothing now if you ever run into a person like that as you saw a multicolored tourist you're gonna get a power-up and as you can see it's given me a bird's eye view of the whole map here so I can sort of go a little bit faster and uh, you want to collect cell phones throughout this as well. As you can see, the boss has just appeared at the top left, and he's going to call me in a few minutes there. And if I don't answer this call, I'm going to be fired. So i got to get my guy to a cell phone, and I can see one up there. I just need to race to it quickly. Ah, I ran into someone, but I need to race to it. I'm going to grab it, and it'll extend my time. Oh, there was the pants. But uh, as you can see, I'm going to cross the street here, grab some cash along the way. Now collecting cash is pretty important because it will allow you to purchase power-ups and upgrades in the store. We'll get into that in just a little bit, but first let's take a closer look at the controls. So you've got the obvious right and left movements, which basically you just swipe right to move right, swipe left to move left, but you've also got speed controls. If you swipe upwards consistently, you're gonna move faster and faster, and obviously it's gonna be harder to avoid the obstacles when you do that. But you can actually swipe downwards and almost make your character or slow down to a standstill. Now this will be useful when you get to later parts of the game where walls show up and you need to make tight turns. You can make them a little bit easier if your character is moving slower. So definitely keep that in mind as you play this game. Now from time to time you will get a lucky three scratch off when you do get fired within the game. And all this is is basically a scratch and win ticket sort of. You can see right there I won because I matched three cash bundles in a row. And that's going to help in the store here. So if we take a look you can use the money you've earned throughout the gameplay as well as your scratch tickets to purchase power-ups like a suit and pants, hyper ties, you can purchase upgrades like dollar magnet, time bonus, faster max speed, bird's eye view, as well as hyper tie power. You can also purchase money if you've run out at the bottom there. Now this app is free. You're gonna get a few tries at the beginning and uh, after you've gone through and been fired a few times, and then you'll have to wait for your lives to rejuvenate uh, over time and you can play again, or you can purchase the full version and play unlimited anytime you want. So let's take another quick look here at the gameplay itself. As you can see, you've got the temple run style where you do always consistently move forward you've got the minecraft graphics and you've got the frogger sort of avoidances with the cars and you really can take advantage of this full map because you can run on the street you can run on the sidewalk you can run into people you can pretty much do anything in this game and uh, it really does become addicting as most of these types of games do and with this one having little twist where you can control your character's speed as well as the motion it really does add to the game itself anyway guys thanks for watching as always this was sidewalker late to work give it a try the link will be in the description down below you can check it out also see if you can beat my high score my high score right now is 8050 if you beat it tweet me a picture or tweet me at my twitter account the link is also in the description and let me know i want to see how many of you can actually beat my score anyway guys as always don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this one hit that like button and i'm going to leave you guys with some gameplay and some sound to finish this off thanks for watching i'll see you in the next one